What up everybody, Ground Trooper here, and we've got <laughs> Brian rebuilding his carbs over here for the uh, Midnight Special. The second time. Uh, the first time you didn't first, rebuild them all yeah, the way. First rebuild, yeah. yeah. So you got the parts now, so you're, you're, you're doing good. He's not giving himself enough credit, he's being an asshole to himself about the rate at which his vintage motorcycle is uh, being repaired, so... Put put some uh, some positive comments for Brian down in the comment section I, below. I won't read them. I, I will, and then I'll yell at him about them. So be sure to leave them. Uh, we got the, the clutch pack all freed up here, which is pretty awesome. Um, I think I showed that in the last video. He's got new switch housings, new levers. They're all gold! And I think they're absolutely gorgeous. We got the clutch lever over here. Verse shiny. He's got Vans grips on here. And uh, the bars are coming off and getting painted black, right? Yeah, but I'll just buy different bars. Okay, yeah. So these these will all come off eventually and get black. We're going we're gonna to order some black uh, drag bars for it or something. But uh, it's going to keep really that, that shape profile. And then uh, we get to go to Hydraulic Line City and replace all these brake lines and... Uh, this weird manifold that's up in here for them that terrifies me. Uh, so we're, we're going to clean the bejesus out of that. I don't want to think about making a custom one of those. And we got our nice clean workstations down here. But today's big win, and by the way, it's, it's supposed to snow tonight. It's absolutely gorgeous outside right now. But uh, we're supposed to get like an inch of snow tonight. But uh, the Grom Chopper version, like 1.1 we'll call it, is... Uh, it was all done. We got a bunch of stuff deleted off of it. I still need to put the exhaust tips on it, but I'm not in any rush to do that. And uh, got the clutch all dialed in. Again, I can't tell you if you've got a Sportster, the extra plate clutch pack from Barnett is absolutely phenomenal. They did not sponsor me. I paid full money for that. They probably don't even know I exist. But uh, great investment. Took me like 20 minutes to get everything fully adjusted into where I wanted it. But uh, yeah, we're, uh, we're making progress here. So this thing's rideable. I just got to uh, throw an insurance policy on it, get it uh, registered, and uh, we'll start doing some, some Harley Davidson vlogs. Hell yeah. I'm just, I'm so happy with how it came out. The, the stance on it is absolutely absurd. And we had to, uh, we had to make it little platform shoes so that it doesn't fall over on the kickstand. It still needs a new kickstand bolt. The one that's in there right now is not the factory one. So it, it wobbles like nobody's business, but small things, it's uh, it's completely rideable at this point though. And that's what's important. So here's our, uh, our bike reveal for this week. Still need to <laughs> finish tuning the VTX. Uh, that, that won't take too long and we'll get that home. But again, I'm not in any rush because despite it being absolutely sunny and beautiful out here, I'm in a t-shirt right now and completely comfortable. It's supposed to get like a high of 35 tomorrow and snow all night tonight. So that's going to suck. But, uh, but back to the 70s by the weekend and uh, maybe I'll get lucky and I'll get into the MVD this week and get, the, get a plate for this thing. We can be out on it this weekend. I still got to convince Brian to uh, to take it out. He uh, he does not want to because of how top heavy it is. And uh, in his words, he's not going down with the ship. So if the bike falls, he's letting it go. And uh, I don't blame him because nobody wants to get crushed by something that's hot and metallic. Believe me, I've been there. So uh, yeah, now uh, what we've got left to do, obviously we're going to focus almost entirely on the Midnight Special because it's really really close to being operational and then uh, I got my hardtail chopper down here to work on with these awesome bars that Brian gifted me that are so perfect chopper bars it's not even funny and uh, he didn't want them so I took him and I put them on here but yeah that's really it uh, no words of advice from the screaming eagle today other than buy a used sportster and put a Barnett uh, extra plate clutch pack in it thanks so much for watching see you guys in the next one peace